Hey guys, I am Shaylee. If you're new around here, I'm going to do a Trader Joe's grocery haul for you guys today. I have a four month old baby that you probably just heard. She's in her swing over there. So yeah, without further ado, we'll get started. I might have to baby wear her in a minute because she's been kind of fussy today. So she might pop in. First things first, I always get flowers at Trader Joe's. How beautiful are these? I got two just because I wanted like a big, beautiful floral arrangement. I've been feeling kind of down. I know this is just a grocery haul. I don't want to get too deep, but um, postpartum is real, you know? So I'm gonna try to fill this up without getting it all over my camera. How beautiful, right? I kind of pictured them hitting the bottom of the vase, but that's okay. <laughs> Losing her shit back there, so let me go get her. Okay, <laughs> we're back. I think this is gonna work. And I know she's a little crooked. She keeps tilting herself, so please don't leave me a mean comment. Okay, so my husband loves these, and these are called inner peas. They are baked like edamame, basically, and they are so good, and I feel like they're not even that bad for you because it's green beans. So this is more for Danny because he loves these, but I like to snack on these too. It's better than Doritos or something like that, so I got those. I got this a while ago. I think when I did a Trader Joe's haul like a long time ago, and it's delicious. It's the peanut butter protein granola. I eat yogurt, fruit, and granola all the time for breakfast. Yummy. And you could just take like a handful of it if you just want something a little sweet as a snack. You know me. You know I love pizza. I love pizza. And someone on Instagram had told me to get these. These are the Trader Joe's cauliflower pizza crusts. The lighting changed. I'm just using the window lighting, so sorry about that. Anyways, these come with two crusts each one. Usually for like little pizzas at Trader Joe's, I'll get the... It's not pita bread, it's like Mediterranean bread. I forget what it's called. I got it in the last haul, but I figured I would try these because I love cauliflower crust and I didn't even know they had these pre-made. I was out of my um, black seeds and chia seeds. I don't know where the chia seeds are. We'll find those in a minute. But yeah, all these little like healthy things that I sprinkle in smoothies or on toast or on salads. I went through and organized our little cupboard a little bit and I had a little bit left of each of them but they were expired because it just takes you forever to go through this huge thing. Milk, pretty self-explanatory. Cereal, that's what I use it for if I eat cereal. Uh, I notice I just do well when I eat a lot of protein but I usually get protein from like cheese and nuts and stuff <laughs> so I wanted to get it in another way so I'm just gonna like throw this in smoothies or um, even like coffee. I'm pretty sure I could just throw this in my coffee. We'll see. I feel like we constantly are going through granola bars because I do. I just keep them with me in like my car, the diaper bag, wherever. I feel like you are so crooked right now, sis. <laughs> Look at that. Anyway, um, I thought this would be kind of a cool option to switch it up. This is breakfast Chex Mix. I love Trader Joe's has these like pre-packaged. See, they're in like little packages. So you could just throw this in your purse wine. The last thing in that bag was wine, but I got three bottles and the other one's buried somewhere, so I'll show you in a minute. But I just replaced our bread. I have been going through bread so much more. I never really ate sandwiches pregnant. Like once in a while I would have a sandwich, but I feel like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches have just been hitting the spot. Turkey sandwiches. Anyways, I just got some green and seed bread for me and then Danny likes sourdough. I love everything but the bagel. Everything. Everything at Trader Joe's that they sell that's everything but the bagel, give it to me. They sell it, I, I got nuts with it, I got crackers with it. Everything but the bagels, bagels. Who knew? They just smell so good. I love everything seasoning. Everything but the gluten crackers is what these are called, but they're basically like everything crackers. I got these in the last haul with this Laughing Cow Cheese and I, ran through these in like probably three or four days. It's just like this spreadable cheese and these crackers are just like seed crackers and it's so good. Like I would just do a little bit of this on a plate with some fruit and then um, maybe like a piece of chocolate or something. <laughs> like I got chocolate almonds, that's perfect. I just like variety. Like I wanna have something sweet, I wanna have something salty, creamy, crunchy, I like all the textures and I just feel like this was such a yummy snack. I feel like on Pinterest I'll pin stuff but I don't ever go back and look at my pinned things like my folders so the other day I went and looked back at some like healthy snack ideas and I had pinned some blueberries that they dipped in protein like what's that called them Greek yogurt and froze them and it looked so good so I got some blueberries and then I got um, sugar plum grape tomatoes just I love those on like avocado toast or in salad I also for the pizzas I got cilantro because I want to make this bowl that I saw on Pinterest too it's like bell pepper which I also got chicken white rice avocado and cilantro on top it's kind of like a 
Cajun style thing, I think, but cilantro, I feel like reminds me of Mexican food. I don't know. It's gonna be good, whatever it is. Strawberries. I cook so much with onions, so I just got a purple one and a white one. Red, I always call them purple. Three avocados, I'm gonna put one in my little fruit basket here and the rest in the fridge. I feel like avocados either you're like, oh my God, none of these are soft enough or they're all mushy. I got limes for that Cajun bowl. Lemons, I love lemon water, tea with lemon. Um, we cook fish a lot, so I always like to have that. I'm gonna take a brief intermission, try to see what's going on with her. Back in focus, she had a dirty diaper. I wouldn't wanna sit in that either. <laughs> we had to change that. Here's the bell peppers for my bowls. So I got vanilla Greek yogurt for the blueberries. And then in the last Trader Joe's haul I did, I got mango and this expired before I got to try it. It got shoved to the back of the fridge and I didn't get to taste it. So I got it again and then I got strawberry vanilla. So I just like grabbing Greek yogurt for in the morning for breakfast or a snack. Oh, there's a cute bird out the window. There's this tree out my kitchen window and it's got a nest right here and I love it in the spring because it just, I don't know, I feel like Snow White living here. I wish I could show you. I'm just gonna try to show you. See that bird right there? Hopping around, there he goes. Right there is a nest. And so, you know, if I'm doing dishes right here, I can just see the cute little birds out the window. Okay, here's the chocolate almonds I was talking about. They're so good, dark chocolate covered almonds. I just grab a handful of these sometimes if I need something sweet. Um, the Columbus turkey is what I get for our sandwiches. We have feta cheese, but I don't make it to Trader Joe's for every shopping trip, so I had to grab it. But it's the crumbled feta cheese with Mediterranean herbs. It's just so good. My favorite way to eat this, where you can just like really taste the flavor for, for some reason, is avocado toast. And I just like pile this on, like a fried egg, some tomato, it's so delicious. And then I love their spicy hummus, so yummy. I always buy hummus, it's just the best, but the spicy hummus is where it's at. I got three different kinds of cheese snack stick Kobe Jack ones at the, the main store like Rayleigh's I get pepper jack sticks lately for my husband's lunch and then I could just grab them I feel like I'm having a hard time talking I said lunch really weird maybe I've had too much caffeine but anyway they didn't have those at Trader Joe's so I just got string, G, string cheese and Colby Jack sticks. And then I got mozzarella shredded cheese for the little pizzas I wanna make. I love, love, love the Trader Joe's salads. I shared these in the last haul. This one is my favorite. Grilled chicken one, sorry about the glare. You can hear golden in the back. And then the Mexicali salad. They didn't have the Southwest one, and I wanna say that's the one they didn't have last time too. Some chicken thighs. There's certain things I'm willing to do to lose weight and there's certain things I'm not. <laughs> like, I guess I would eat a chicken breast. I'm making that sound dr so dramatic, but I'm like, a chicken breast over a thigh, why? So one struggle I have as a new mom for breakfast is a lot of times I'll like wake up, <laughs> you hear her just talking? I'll get um, coffee, but then I like won't eat until well into the afternoon on accident, unless I grab a granola bar or something. So. Then I just feel like I'm eating like processed stuff. Like I don't have fruits or vegetables or like a sandwich. I'll have like granola bars a couple times and that's not good. So anyways, I got these very green juices. They're just juice smoothies. There we go. They're just like fruit smoothies. So it has a lot of good stuff. Spirulina, broccoli, ginger, spinach, parsley, garlic. Anyways, I grabbed two of these. I figured I could just like take a swig of this feel a little healthier. <laughs> and then they also had these two other ones sitting by it. Banana almond butter protein smoothie. Yum. Hey baby girl. I hear you over there. And then the vanilla almond spiced chai. One more bag and then we're done. Oh, this is what I got for me. The peanut butter protein granola I will totally eat, like I said, but Danny loves that one. I got grainless granola. It's just like basically a bunch of nuts. I got everything but the bagel nuts. I told you guys, like I'm obsessed with this stuff. These you can find at Target too, but I saw them at Trader Joe's and I grabbed a couple. They're the RX bars. I love these. It just has exactly what it says on the cover. And the ingredients, they, they are held together by dates. So they're kind of sticky. I love them. Um, but you know, some people don't like that texture like in their teeth. But I got the chocolate sea salt one, chocolate peanut butter. And then I ate the other one on the way home. I got two of these too. It was delicious. These ones are the chocolate raspberry and I had never had it before. I should have gotten more of this flavor. I had to get new eggs. I feel like we had like two dozen in there. I don't know how we went through them so quickly, but 
got more of those. And then I just grabbed some green chilies, black beans and pinto beans. I think I'm gonna make like an Instapot. Ah! I just like really messed up my floor really bad by dropping that. There's like a big chunk out of the wood. Oh my God. Anyway, I wanna make like a Instapot soup. It's supposed to rain later this week, so I always love soup, so I got um, this stuff for soup. Last thing was that other wine bottle. To be honest, I usually pick out wine by the bottle because I just like to pick out pretty stuff and I just try different ones that way. I like white wine more in spring and summer, so this is a bottle with uh, Monstera all over it, so that's why I picked it. It says the delicious monster. And then this one, again, it's just pretty, that bottle. And then this one, um, reminded me of Great Gatsby. Doesn't that just look really pretty, like the Great Gatsby or something? I don't know why. Ferrari, Carano, I don't even know, you guys. I just pick out the pretty bottles, and then if I like it, I buy it again if I remember. So that's everything. I hope you enjoyed this video. It wasn't too distracting with everything going on. I'm just trying to embrace the realness and throw the camera up and just make a video. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys with another video soon.